Adaptations of the Red Blood Cell by kscience.com. A red blood cell has a biconcave shape. As you can see here, I'm drawing a red blood cell with a biconcave shape. This biconcave shape increases the surface area of the red blood cell, which increases the rate of diffusion of oxygen into and out of the cell. I'm now going to compare the surface areas of a cell with a biconcave and without a biconcave shape. So this is without a biconcave shape, and this red blood cell has a biconcave shape, as you can see. So these are the entry points for the non-biconcave red blood cell. So there's 14 centimeters of surface area, whereas on the biconcave red blood cell, there are going to be 18 entry points as 18 centimeters of surface area. So as you can see here, the biconcave shape gives the red blood cell a larger surface area to increase the rate of diffusion of oxygen in and out of the cell. I'm now going to introduce to you a new keyword, urethrocyte, which means red blood cell. So inside a urethrocyte, there is hemoglobin. So the H shows hemoglobin inside the red blood cell. So hemoglobin is what oxygen binds. So I'm now showing you the oxygen binding the hemoglobin. So it's an adaptation. But a red blood cell, aka urethrocyte, has lots of hemoglobin. The more hemoglobin, the more oxygen can bind the hemoglobin and therefore it can carry more oxygen. So it's got many hemoglobin, so more oxygen binds, therefore it can carry more oxygen. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. The last adaptation is a urethrocyte has no nucleus. If it had a nucleus, it would carry less hemoglobin. So it does not have a nucleus. So there is no nucleus in a urethrocyte. Therefore, it can carry more hemoglobin and therefore more oxygen binds and oxygen is carried in a higher concentration. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Visit kscience.com for more free videos, worksheets, and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.